Hi, my name is Samir Malik and I'm a private tutor for middle school and high school students in the Austin area. Today we're going to be discussing set notation and how we use it. Now set notation is basically just writing down as a term uh, of explaining a set of numbers. So for example, if you have a Venn diagram uh, explaining numbers in set A and set B and their common interests, you would use the set notation to emphasize on which part of that Venn diagram you're trying to focus on. So to better understand this, I wanted to illustrate some examples as well so you have a better idea of a set notation. So if you'd like to take a look here, I'll show you some examples of set notation. I'm going to have the set notation the way we write it down, set notation. And then I'm also going to illustrate with the Venn diagram. So our set notation would be A, U, B, which would mean here's our Venn diagram for A and B, and it would basically include everything that is in either set A and set B. The next set notation would be A, and then a little arrow going in the upper direction, B, and on a Venn diagram, we would show A and B as well, except this only the center section would be shaded because this symbol here stands for only the things that are in both the sets of A and B. In other words, the common interest of A and B. And then the third one that I would like to illustrate for you is A, and then we have a little minus symbol, B. And then in our Venn diagram, we have A and B, and we're only going to shade the portion of A in this particular diagram because this is everything in A except for anything in its overlap with B. So only specific to A and just A alone, and nothing that overlaps or is in common with B is going to be shaded. So these are some examples of set notations followed by Venn diagrams to help you understand what the set notations actually mean. So from here we're able to understand set notations, how they are written, followed by diagrams to help us understand what those set notation symbols really mean.